Hello everyone, so for this video I'm going to be doing a book haul. I went to, so I'm on vacation right now, and I went to a bunch of different stores. Um, one was a, like a book outlet store where all the books are like 50 to 80% off, and I was like, yeah, love some new books, I'm going to go. And I got like five, five there I think, and then the other day I went to Goodwill. And it's in like a smaller town where I am, so like the Goodwill, the book section is actually really good. And I ended up getting two, two books there, I think. So, start now. Um, oh my gosh, I need to separate this. Okay. So the first two books are, they're just some cheesy like werewolf books. And it was, ow, if you found the red, the red tag, like, red like this, then you could get, buy two, get one free, and I was like, of course I want to buy two, get one free, but I had a hard time finding three that I like, so I just kind of got some cheesy ones that were really good price. And those were 60, 70, and 60% off. And one of those is this one, Love Sucks, I don't know, I think it's about being a vampire, another cheesy vampire book. I just love those type of books because like I started liking to read with Twilight and I've always just like liked vampires, werewolves, witches, all those type of stuff. And then this one is I went up to the front to check out and there was a little basket that said if you're buying books you can get any book in this basket for 50 cents and I was like of course I'm gonna buy another book like 50 cents like you can never find books that cheap. And uh, it's about a demon hunter, and I've read one book about a demon hunter, and I thought it was quite interesting. I also like Supernatural, so hopefully it'll be similar to that. And then this one, another cheesy vampire book. I don't know, when I get bored I just want to read cheesy books, and it's fun to get out of reading slumps. And then the last one is... Earthbound by April and Pike, and she also, if you've read Wings, it's like about a fairy girl finding out she's like, she grew up in with human parents, which finds out she's a fairy, and it's like the same author, and I've been wanting to read it for a while, and it was, I don't know, I lost the sticker, but it was like 80% off, I think, and it's about like this girl who's in a plane crash, and she like, her parents die. And she's trying to search for answers about what happened. She doesn't really remember much, I think. It sounds interesting. I like the author. I figure I like this book. So these are the books from Goodwill now. This one is A Kiss in Time, and it's by Alex Flynn. If you've read Beastly, it's the same author. And this one, it goes along the same lines of the fairy tale. And I think it's Sleeping Beauty is what it's based on because it says like this girl was under a spell and the guy broke the spell and there's a spindle and they kiss so I'm assuming it's like that just like how Beastly was Beauty and the Beast the author's just doing another retelling of it and I, I figured I like Beastly probably will like this book and it was oh no I might have been, oh 99 cents I could not not get it for 99 cents like that's so cheap and the last one is House of Hades, and this is the fourth book in the Heroes of Olympus series. It's by Rick Riordan. Riord, I don't know how to say it. I'm sorry if I said it wrong. And he's the author of the Percy Jackson series. And if you like the Percy Jackson series, you'll definitely like this series. It's about uh, a son of Zeus and Percy. They like get switched into Greek and Roman camps because the Greek and Romans have to unite for this battle that's going on. And it's really good. And I'm, I finished the second already, and I still have to read the third. But I saw this one there, and I was like, I was gonna buy the fourth anyway, so I might as well get it. And it was like four dollars. This is originally twenty dollars, and this looks like pristine condition. Like there's no dents, no tears, nothing. I was like, of course I'm gonna get it. Yeah, I really love this series though. And after this series, I'm going to read The Trials of Apollo that just came out. And that one's about, like, Apollo, like, I don't know, I think he broke a rule or something. So Zeus turned him human, and he's, like, stuck in a teenage body. I don't know, I just really love Rick Riordan's writing. Like, his writing is pretty much for all ages, in my own opinion. Like, people base it in middle school, 
period like age like my cousin he's 14 and he loves this author too but I mean I'm 20 and I love this author so I just think anyone can read it it's just a really good story he's a really good author so if you haven't you should look into this series so that's all I have for this video I hope you liked it subscribe if you did comment anything you want me to see or do or what you thought and like it please okay bye